everyone was expecting uh, uh, something from Aaron Rodgers um, and his world in short order with franchise tags today needing to be handed out today and the best receiver in the National Football League and Devontae Adams needing a new deal himself and the Packers needing to make a decision. If you're coming, you're going. Because if you're going, then that might affect how we handle Devontae Adams. Yeah, I know the new league year is next week, but today is kind of the day that that Rodgers needed to deliver his message. Of course, as you know, (laughs) he has his own sense of timing last year based on whatever he needs to do for himself. And uh, obviously, um, this year he does have more uh, team considerations because he feels that he's in better standing. Um, uh, The relationship between he and his team is in a much better standing and I've said all along, best spot for him to, to wind up um, is to stay put. Mm-hmm. Stay put. You're, you're 17 years in in this place. You, 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 you've you got everything kind of set up the way you like it. I'm sure his car could essentially drive itself to work <laughs> at this point in time. And he seems to like everybody who's there. He seems to have Pretty a better close. relationship with the general manager and, and um, team president. And sure enough, Comes back today, Ian Rappaport announcing a contract extension. As you all know, he's got one more year left on his deal there. Contract extension, four years, $200 million. Baby. A buck 53 guaranteed, Ooh. according to Ian Rappaport, my colleague, Rap Sheet, who was on yesterday's program. And what this means, if he plays all five years, let's say he plays all five years, I would give him 22 years in Green Bay. 18, 19, 20, 21, 20, 22. Just 17 years in. 22 years in Green Bay, setting another benchmark that no one will touch in Green Bay. 22 years in Green Bay if he finishes this thing out. And um, as you know, Bart Starr, he's already been there longer than Bart Starr. Longer than Favre, Mikowski. Rogers setting a benchmark in Green Bay that no one will touch, and that includes Jordan Love. <laughs> How amazing is this? <laughs> How amazing is this? And it is a testament to belief in self, betting on self, and also breaking stuff to make sure that you understand or that everyone else understands what your point of view is. How about this? Drafting Jordan Love in 2020 after Aaron Rodgers shows he can work well with a new coach who's never done it before. Go ahead and get a kid. Start the clock that he knows, Aaron Rodgers knows, that at the very least, at the very least, very least, by 2022, they're going to have to start him in order to see what they've got in the kid that they just traded into the – Trade it up the first round and go get. By 2022, they're going to have to put him out there because after the 2022 season, they're going to have to figure out, does he get a fifth-year extension? I mean, you got the time's ticking. And Aaron Rodgers gave him a freebie year of 2020, which is why in 2021, he's just like, okay, I might not come back anymore, everybody. Go watch me on Jeopardy. And um, he comes back for 2021. And just like 2020, he wins the MVP. Back-to-back MVP awards. And here we are at the outset of the new league year in 2022. And he is a four-year, $200 million contract now placed in front of him to sign. And that means Jordan Love is definitely not starting for the Green Bay Packers in 2022, even if Aaron Rodgers can't go because Jordan Love, no doubt in my mind, will be history. See ya. How about that? Unbelievable turn of events that the Green Bay Packers did what they had to do. This had to happen. I don't think, I didn't think they should draft a Jordan Love at all. I told you right from the get-go what are they thinking what are you doing Rodgers just gets better and I know he has his detractors 
and haters as a football player. I'm not talking about the other stuff because the other stuff, this is the most successful <laughs> cancellation ever. The one who got canceled is Jordan, Jordan Love. Love. He's a uh, uh, for it, man. <laughs> this is the greatest cancellation in the history of cancellations. In the history of culture and cancels and culture and cancels. Got canceled in $153 million. Uh, so, I, I know he's got his detractors in terms of football. I'm not one of those guys at all. I know he didn't hit certain receivers at certain points in time when all the chips are down. And I know you could sit here and say the Green Bay Packers aren't really built for the cold. And they've lost the last two playoff games at home when they had the one seed. <laughs> For the first time in Green Bay, if first time Aaron Rodgers had the NFC Championship game at home because he had the one seed, they lose that, and then they get the one seed again, and they can't even get to the NFC Championship game. And you can definitely, in this quarterback-driven league, look at the quarterback and say, that's his fault. But you're the Green Bay Packers, and you've got a guy who's one of the all-time greats, which he is, and he's got 17 years under his belt there, and you're saying, uncle, <laughs> uncle, Jordan Love, not the right move. He's not your successor. Your successor right now is you. We're sticking with you. You are... Our Tom Brady. You're our Tom Brady. You don't have as many rings as Tom Brady, but you're our Tom Brady. You're our guy who's been here for a long time. You are generationally brilliant. You are our guy. And we are going to bet on you to have the longevity after the age of 37 that Tom Brady has shown or did show, if you want to use the past tense. And they are, he's their Tom Brady. Here you go. Here's the contract that you required to make us show you Jordan Love isn't our guy. You're our guy, Aaron. Mea culpa. Uncle. We love you. Who saw that coming? I guess Aaron Rodgers. Bet on self. Believe in self. What a message that is. Take care of your own business. Take care of your body and make it happen. A total reversal of fortune and what a fortune it is. Again, if these numbers are spot on.